what, three days ago? So they gave me that copyright, non-copyright, and here we're at it again. And I'm using the stuff that they gave me. Okay, here we go again. Well, I don't know what to think about this. My uh, Big Dresden Quilt 2. And I did it two years ago. So, I don't understand what's going on. The music in it is from them and from Rick. And today is June the 2nd. That's today. And at 4 o'clock this morning, I got an email saying that I have a copyright strike without a copyright strike. Something about Matilda is hidden. So, how could it be hidden? And the only music I used was what they provided for me and Rick's music, which those are so old and all that they don't need, that you can't have a copyright strike on it no more. It's, I, I'm not getting it. I don't understand it. But they drug it up from two years ago. This is just, what's it's crazy, really crazy. Well, uh, I went and asked a question, and if you can see it, you can tell I did not get a straight answer. And this was from two years ago. You would think that they would not be so picky. Should I stay on YouTube, or should I just get off of it and do my own thing. This is crazy. As YouTube creators, we should not have to worry about this. I mean, they could pretty well much tell where you get the music from. And if you record on it, you sh they should be able to tell it. So, are they picking on me or something? I feel like they are, but why? Why are they picking on us?